videos I'm coming out, but it's coming out good and it will be very glorious. What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu walkthrough. Okay, so no other cut screens. We are finally here. It is finally time to take on Misty, the uh, second gym leader right here of uh, Cerulean City. Let's go right ahead and see. Yes, yeah, Cerulean City Pokemon Gym, Gym Leader, Misty. The Tomboyish Mermaid. Okay, so let's go right ahead and, uh, well, first is first. We gotta, we gotta take care of the essentials, and that is we gotta buy some healing items because I don't feel too comfortable going in there right now and simply just being her. Uh-uh. And since we do have a nugget with us, it will actually help us right here. So, uh, let's see. Let's see. We got we can buy more Pokeballs if we wanted, but what we need is more potions. So, let's see. Eh, yeah, we could spend for 21 right there. It's no biggie right now. And then, let's go right ahead and not do that. Let's go right ahead and sell this, uh, sell the nugget. And yes, we got ourselves 5,000. So we'll, we're going to be fine right here. Now, in this gym, you do need Grass-type Pokemon or Electric-type Pokemon. Plain and simple. But there is another rule to this that I, I found out when I first played this. And I believe you have to have a Pokemon above 20, level 20. I could be wrong, though. So let's go right ahead inside the gym right here. As you can see, it looks like a big old swimming pool. Look at that. Beautiful women. Beautiful swimming pool. This guy right here. Yo, champ in the making. Misty, the gym leader of the Cerulean City Gym, is a powerful trainer. You'll need a Pokemon at least level 15 if you want to challenge her, gym. Show me a Pokemon at least level 13 if you want to take on this gym. Well, this is very simple. I'm going to show off Charmander right here. Impressive! I see you have a Pokemon that's at least level 15. In that case, head on in and good luck. Alrighty. Now... Yeah, that won't be the best decision right there ever, going with Charmander. So what we're going to be doing is we're going to be going straight for Bulbasaur right here. And hope this pans out right here. So here comes the very first person. Man, this is awesome. Appearing in the Glamis Flash, my Pokemon will totally stomp you. Okay, alrighty. So here we go. Very first Pokemon battle in the Cerulean City Gym. Going up against Beauty Lily. And she will be coming out with her Goldeen. Now, there is one little problem with this, and that is that Goldeen may have pack. But well, let's go, Bulbasaur. Let's see if we can actually do this right here. Let's go, Vine Whip attack. And I was correct. This guy has a peck attack right here. But Vine Whip does its thing. So it's a battle of attrition right here. Here, attrition right here. Here comes that quick attack. Didn't know that Goldeen can actually learn quick attack. So let's go with another Vine Whip. Nearly takes this guy out, so let's go one more time. Vine Whip, come on. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Nearly takes me out right there. And there it goes. Goldeen has been defeated. Yes, sir. Look at that. And we defeated Lily. Okay. Alrighty. So, let's go right ahead and switch out our Pokemon. I guess the best Pokemon for this is uh, Sparky. Now, I did teach Mew a few moves. Knowing that it's Mew, it can learn any Pokemon move out there. And what I'm going to do right now is I'm actually going to heal my Pokemon right here too. Because I don't want this guy to faint if I need it. Now, let's go right ahead and take on some more Pokemon trainers. Here's the second one right here. Look at her. Hmm, me? I'm a beautiful girl who glides in the on the water. Okay, alrighty. Bring it. Let's go. Beauty Violet wants the battle, and she will be coming out with her shelter right here. Alrighty. So here we go, Sparky. I know you can do this. Let's get this. Let's, uh... Well, let's go with a Zippy Zap right here. Shelter, I'm sorry, but I'm gonna have to zap you. Look at that. Say goodbye to Shelter. Oh, yes. <laughs> Defeated. And, well, Violet has been defeated. She is soaked. Well, you have been soaked because you swam in the water, but whatever. So that was very easy. And, well, let's see. Who, who deserves another chance right here? Actually, you know what? Let's just go with Pikachu. Let's just go. All right. Let's see what you can do, girl. Get over here. 
Did you see the dive, uh, that dive just now? Don't you think I, it's deserving of a gold medal? Yes, if I defeat you. No, then you get silver medal. <laughs> it's, just, it's, it's just the truth. So here we go. Beauty Daisy wants the battle, and she will be coming out with her seal right here. And let's go with Sparky. Let's go, buddy. All right, here we go. Zippy Zap for the win. Yeah. Look at that. Quick and easy. Oh, yes. No more seal. Look at that. And, well, Daisy has been defeated. I am victorious, and I am awesome right here. So, let's go right ahead and switch out our Pokemon. Uh, yeah, you know what? I'm going to take a chance with Bulbasaur right here, and then eventually we're just going to... Actually, hold on. Let's go right ahead and move this out, because I did realize something. Staryu is, or Star Me is a psychic type Pokemon, so kind of want to keep an eye out for that. So here we go, Misty. What up, homegirl? Hi, you're a new face. What's your policy on Pokemon? What's your approach? My policy is, uh, my policy for battle is an all-out offensive with water Pokemon. Misty, the world famous beauty, is your host. My sweet Pokemon are ready. Are you? Let's go. Gym battle number two, and it's against our good old friend Misty right here. All right, homegirl, it's been a while. I missed you, but here she comes out with the Psyduck. The Psyduck, get ready for this move right here. Zippy Zap. Yeah, buddy. Zippy Zap. Away. Yeah, this Pokemon had no chance whatsoever. <laughs> Flexing my muscles. Oh, yes. Look at that. Pokemon are gaining levels. Scyther has grown to level 20, and it wants to learn agility. Let's go ahead and teach it agility, I think. Yeah, let's go take away double team. Yes, yeah, Scyther has been a very good Pokemon, but right now I wouldn't be able to use it now. And here she comes out with a Starmie, so let's go right ahead and just continue on with Sparky right here. All right. All right. Here we go. Zippy Zap for the win. Oh, yes. Zippy Zap nearly takes out Sarmie, and oh my god, here comes its side whip attack. And that right there did something. So here we go, one more Zippy Zap for the win. Eat it! Oh, yes. No chance whatsoever. Sparky kicking ass, taking names, and looking good while it's doing it. Look at that. Yeah, buddy. Mew grows to level 14. And everybody else does its thing. Wow, you are too much! Yes, baby, I am. <laughs> Look at that. Alright, you can have the Cascade Bash to show you that you beat me. That's right. Look at that. Fist bump. Fist bump me, buddy. Throwing out that peace sign. Look at that. Cascade Badge. A Cascade Badge makes Pokemon up to level 30 from other trainers listen to you. And you can also use my favorite TM. TM29 Scald, which is a very good move. TM29 teaches a Pokemon Scald. Use it on a, a use it on a Pokemon that lives in the water. All right, let's go ahead and talk to her one last time. Uh, okay, so that's pretty much it right there. So there we go, guys. We got our second badge. Talk to this guy. You beat Misty. Great job. The splashes of your battles, uh, your battle came all the way over here. That's right. Kicking ass, taking names, feeling good while I'm doing it. Okay, so after doing that, I think that's pretty much it right there. So, yeah, Prof our Officer Jenny won't, she'll get out of the way right there. So, this is pretty much it for this episode, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. In the next one, we're going to be going straight to Vermilion City and on. And, uh, yeah, we're going to be completing a lot more battling a lot more and doing a lot more so thank you guys for watching i will see you guys next time